This is part two of how to clean lampshades. Now, empty your water. If you don't want to use the water you use for your dishes, that would have been a smart thing to do beforehand. Just try to get the lampshade off and it would not even turn. Even though I have these, uh, I don't know what they're for, but they're for something. Could get a bit of a grip, was not happening. So, we are going to do lampshade with fringe. Never wash this with the fringe. This is um, like a mother of pearl. You see it in the light. It's quite nice. I don't think I've ever soaked this. I don't think I will soak this. I might just slightly soak this one. And this is an old one of my my mother-in-law's mother's. Now, it is currently broken. It's a three uh, light thing, Bob, one, two, three. Uh, it broke a while ago, so we're going to do that in the future. How to repair light. Here, you have little Screw you turn. Now there probably should be one on the other side. No. Here we go. That I will soak. Hot water. Get the wrench out of your sink. I don't think I want it super hot though. This water is really hot. I'm gonna go from lukewarm with just a little bit of dish soap. So I want to come up to about halfway in the sink. It has a little bit of a design. It looks like it was painted on. So, not too hot. Just give it a little rinse around. It's sitting, hiding for a while while I figure out how to fix it. Oh, really? Nice. Just let that one drip dry. Perfect, nice and dry. This one, I'm just going to slightly, you see, see how beautiful it is? Don't mind this. I found this on the road, obviously how after someone had moved out, they didn't want to throw it away, they left it on the sidewalk. If you're from a big city, you know that that basically is the rule. You don't need any more, just put it on the sidewalk. And literally, I can count 45 minutes and it'll be gone. Doesn't matter what it is. A lot of people with no money, if you're buying a new pair of shoes, the old ones are still good. Put them on the street. There's a lot of older gentlemen living on nothing. Now, this is not a case of putting outside. I don't know if I'd want to put this outside. I just want to let this dry. So you can see the coloring. Yes, it's not perfect, but pretty damn cool. And Ikea did not make it. We're going to give it a try and see. It is uh, gross. Should probably have washed this before. So let's give it a try. I'm going to put some cool water in. Oh my god. Gross. water in just because don't want to be too hot and you don't know if the fringe will run. Doesn't seem to be running at all. Seems pretty good actually. Wash cloth. Just put a tea towel here. I don't know what Americans call tea towels because they always seem to have towels. I was finding weird. What 
is a tea towel? Excellent question. Okay, wow, this has come out amazingly well. Let's rinse it with cold, shall we? So let it drip a bit. See if there's any spots that look really, really gross. This is a new lamp. Found it in my recycling room. Again, another thing in the city. You find amazing things in the recycling room. Like princess, I found in the recycling room. So, good. Looks much better. Let that drip dry. Just enough so it's not terribly drippy. Then put it outside. Let it dry in the sun. It's a beautiful day, that's why we're doing this. Remember to do thumbs up. It really does matter. Even thumbs down. If you think I suck, please tell me. I'll improve next time. And subscribe. When you're first starting out, just so you know, you need a thousand subscribers and then it gets YouTube's attention. If you don't have a thousand subscribers, you do not get YouTube's attention. And I plan on being here a while and doing some great stuff and learning with you. So that's my goal. Continue learning, learning with you. Try keeping the bread <laughs> plastic bag getting in the shot. And uh, I've really enjoyed this. I hope you are too. Thanks.